So I think CMOs uh, can use the opportunity presented by digital convergence in a number of ways. I think broadly what we're seeing um, is that more media is becoming digitised, we're seeing marketing becoming truly cross-channel, we're seeing consumers using multiple devices and I think the key for any CMO is the ability to be able to deliver engaging, relevant customer or brand experiences to customers. So that's a really, you know, that is, is, is a critical thing. Um, it is really about marketing, I think, within many organisations and, and technology coming together with a common agenda which is actually driving a customer-centric experience across devices and across platforms. It's really all about being able to leverage data to deliver these very relevant, engaging cust customer experiences across devices, ultimately to achieve the, the marketing and uh, business objectives for, for the company or brand. Digital Convergence offers CMOs an amazing opportunity to really look at different aspects of the business and bring them into to what they're producing for marketing and communications. It's a case of evolving that role of the CMO. You know, they need to hug the CTO and really embrace technology and bring those teams together. They need to hug the CIO and look at data and think about what that data and insight really can do in terms of informing marketing and communication, but also the output. A marketeer's point of view, particularly in this country where we're bombarded with so many price messages, it would be great if marketeers using some of that data of the, of the campaigns that they're putting out in that point of engagement transaction, that we can get a better understanding of what consumers want I think the biggest change in terms of what digital convergence brings to CMOs is really about that delivery. So in going from maybe three or four brand cam campaigns a year to something that's more of a continuous communication strategy, but also something that really engages that community, their audience, their customer. The first role of a marketeer is to champion the customer in an organisation. You're the only people who will truly have an external perspective and champion that in the organisation is the marketeer. So the marketeer's role is to champion the customer. Now, if you want to champion the customer, then of course you must embrace technology. And if you want your business to reinvent itself, then you must embrace technology. Today's future is all about technology and the businesses which su succeed will be able to uh, transform their customer experiences and their customer offerings by embracing technology. And in order to be able to do that, you must be able to talk to your IT department. Yeah, and if, if you will not succeed in the future, if you cannot talk, as a marketeer, if you cannot talk to your IT department. I think CMOs can use a lot, have a lot of access to these technologies. Um, there's not short of new technologies that are coming out. Part of the challenge is, is how they understand the benefits to them and their customers. Um, we have something within Tesco called reverse mentoring. So we actually we get grads or, or kind of young people that are new to the business to reverse mentor our senior exec team so they can understand what Snapchat is and all the kind of new technologies. And that really helps in terms of at the, at the high level of the business understanding how, what the impact is for some of these new technologies and actually what the benefits will be for customers moving forward. Um, I guess the challenge for most CMOs is working out where to start. Um, I think that's a journey that we've been on for quite some time. Um, you've got to get the basics right, you've got to look, be looking at mobile websites and apps as and when it's appropriate and the key thing is to use data to give you some insight to make sure they're the most appropriate things for you to invest in. So I think CMOs today um, struggle with technology um, and I think you know it's the complexity of that particular landscape. So if we think about the emergence of um, marketing, you know, marketing technology or marketing technology coming to the fore, that's created a lot of pressure on CMOs who traditionally, um, you know, have a different skill set. So that requires CMOs either to become conversant, you know, with with technology and with systems, and to be able to to navigate a very complex and fragmented landscape or it's a case of hiring new skills into the business. And I think what's interesting, you know, we are starting to see the emergence um, of the marketing technologist. Uh, and I think that's something that will continue. And I think, you know, it, it is challenging for, for senior marketers. Um, when you look at how complex the technology landscape is, how fragmented it is, how many players are in the market, how many different types of technology exist within an organization. 
Um, and that, that does create a challenge. Marketing, you know, is, is actually about now bridging the gap between really the, the, the kind of creative and brand um, led side to marketing and the, the very kind of technology and data led side. Um, CMO, CMOs need to be able to bring that together. Uh, if they can't do that, then it's about bringing the, the relevant skills uh, into the organisation. <laughs>